this could be us So back to what I was saying This could be us Hey guys, what's going on? This is the Marvelous Mr. M here, and back with another video. So, in today's video, I'll be teaching you how to draw a stingray. Stingrays are very cool, so let's begin. So first, we're going to start off with some eyes, and they're going to look kind of almost like a triangle, but, but rounded. They're not really a triangle, just like, you know, kind of almost like one. Um... And of course, draw lightly because you saw I just made a mistake there. So uh, make sure you're sketching lightly so that you can erase if necessary. So then you're going to do a line right there, kind of curving right there, curving up, curving down again. And of course, keep try to keep this light. Try not to make it too dark. And this is going to be the, uh, the fins of the stingray right around the eyes. And it's, you're gonna kind of you're gonna have an arch there, and then you're gonna come back around to do like the bottom right there, and then you're gonna come back around right there, have a little arch there, and that'll come up, come around, and you can see these are like the layers because stingrays, you know, they have um, their fins are able to uh, to move quite a bit, so we're showing all of that in this drawing right here and then come back up right there curve around and soon we're gonna be drawing the tail here really soon here so to build up to that we're drawing all this right now and then this is where the tail comes in so you're gonna come up with a, a, a little curve right there to make that a uh, long pointy tail and then underneath of that you're going to draw that shape right there and then even lighter maybe even lighter than what you're doing before sketch around the eyes right there in that shape and then on the back of the stingray we're having something like that and then go all the way around it with uh with the dark line and try to make that line as smooth as possible. So you try to go around very smoothly, just like this. And we're gonna be we're gonna be tracing over most of what we drew with this with this uh darker line. Tracing over the uh the sketch. So we're just going to be outlining most of what we already drew right here. Just like that. Go back around the eyes like that. And then now just shade in that, uh, that eye like that. And then on the other side, on the left side, you're going to shade like that with a little bit of gray right there just a little bit but it's gonna be it's gonna be dark though and then around the eyes could do some markings there oh and of course erase anything if you need to erase just like that so some markings around the eyes just some dark markings like that and then we're gonna be adding some value in here so like the darker uh, darker shades we're gonna be doing that you know, and then eventually we'll be able to go back and uh, and blend this better once we're done. And then around the fins, there's going to be this dark marking right here that's going to go around. Just like that. And then underneath right there, as you can see, where you can see like the belly of the stingray right there, along with the fins, because... That's how stingrays are built. And so we're going to go underneath of the stingray with that marking as well, just like that. And some areas are going to be slightly darker than other areas. And make any corrections that you need to make. And then above the eyes, you're going to have some darker markings like that. 
where you have that darker shading, continue that dark marking right there on the fins. There will be some other areas with some lighter shading as well, but right now we're mainly uh, focusing on the darker shading, the darker values here. Got some more dark shading right there to the side, and then we're working on the tail, so some dark shading right there. And then we're gonna be outlining that one line that we put on the back of the stingray and now we're gonna be going over with some lighter shading and eventually we're gonna be able to blend all that together to where it'll look better so just go around just like that just like that and then pretty soon here we're going to use blending sticks, blending tools, or shading tools, whatever you want to call it. Pretty soon we're going to be using those to, uh, to help blend this better. And then right around the eyes here, we're going to do some darker shading right on the right on the sides, on the top of the eyes, and then some little bit lighter shading at the bottom. And now is where we use the shading tools. And if I didn't say this already, this is the first time I've used shading tools in a video on my channel. And shading tools are gonna just help blend this together. Just help it make, help it look more blended as well as just really bringing out some of these, uh, some of these like values, some of the light and dark just bring it out more help blend it together so and uh try not to blend it too much but if you ever make a mistake you can always go back and fix it just by using your pencil again and just shading that or erasing you can always do that if you need to and then we're gonna go around with that go around that those black markings on the fins just like that and on the main body of the stingray as well help just blend that together more and then of course there's a little there's just some light light blending on the belly right there on the white belly and then we're just going to go back with a pencil and just bring out some of these uh some of these markings more some of the dark shading just go back and we're also we're adding some dots right here to give the stingray a bit of texture so just make some small dots some can be bigger than others and then we're and then we're going to go back and make some dark shading right there and we are mostly done here we're just now just touching it up by making some of those shadings darker, those markings right on the fins, I'm, I'm making those darker. Especially right under, uh, on the, right in that area, on the, the, the tip of the stingray right there. And then just going back, just adding some more dark shading. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video.